Chloe here, back with another crafting video, where today, you know the video I did yesterday when I made a miniature iPad, well today I'm going to be making a miniature console, so yeah, this is going to be a really easy DIY to make, but I know not all of you guys have clay, but I'm just going to make it something out of something else instead of clay, so yeah. Please leave a like and subscribe to Chloe ABC if you haven't already. Let me know in the comments down below. Give me some really cool video ideas or some really cool miniature ideas. And let me know in the comments down below what timestamp you saw the mermaid image yet. And you'll be giving a shout out in one of my videos. I don't know which video, but you're going to get a shout out in a, in a video. So, yeah. <laughs> Let's get started. What you're going to need is some black craft foam. You can get this at any craft store. Buttons. Glue. Red. Glue. And yellow paint. A spare hot glue stick. Scissors. And a sitting piece of paper. White paper. And a pencil. This is a lot of stuff you need for this craft, so just take another look at everything you need. Buttons, craft foam, paint, paper, scissors, pencil, hot glue, extra hot glue stick. Let's get started. Yeah. Oh wait, no, hold on. Where did my toothpicks go? Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Let me go get those. Sorry for making a sketch of your console on a piece of white paper. So I'm doing like one of those gaming consoles. Yeah, you know what I mean. So let me go sketch that out. Okay, you sketch it out, go ahead and cut it out. Okay, instead of drawing it, cause it's really hard for me to draw it, I decided to print it out. So it'll be also helping you out with the buttons. So, so yeah, this is going to be my template. So next what you wanna do is take a piece of craft foam. I'm using black because that's the color of my controller. And taking a pencil. Why do I keep using a pencil? Okay, I'm just going to use a toothpick to kind of like score around it. But yeah, that'll leave a score. So you just want to just, just trace it with a toothpick. Like that. Do you guys see that? Yeah, I think you can see it. Yeah. Okay. And then you want to cut it out. You know how I said mini console, but I mean controller. Is that the same thing? I think that's the same thing. Oh well. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I finished cutting it out. Like that. And now time for the buttons. Now following the pattern on the template, I'm gonna use that for the buttons. So here are the four colors you need. Oh, I forgot to say, you also need white. Eh, get over here. I'm not doing the original colors because I kind of want to make it my own. So, ah! Like I said, following the template, dip your toothpick into some paint, and then use it for the buttons. So, there's one right here. And then, clean off the toothpick. Put the cap on the yellow paint, and then do the same thing for all of the other colors. Here's blue, and this one would go right here. Do the same. I don't know if you guys can see it on camera, but the blue is layer. Kind of the color of my nails. Okay, so if you want to continue. Just doing it, and I'll be back. Three buttons that might work. So this one, it even has that little thing at the bottom, so I can just kind of push it in. Or this button, which is a little bit smaller. It's more of a navy, and there's also this one. So let's see. Ah! Okay, let's see which one's the best. Um, yeah, so let me try. So there's this one. Ooh, that'll work. It kind of does look like a joystick. Let me find a smaller one though. Okay, this one, actually that one might work. These are all so hard. 
Okay, I don't, this one's, the color is off. I think I might go with this one, but I'm only going to do one because it's so big. If I had a smaller one, I would definitely do it. But, hold on. That one's the color off. I found this one. Ugh, let me get it. I just found this one. Smaller, but it's more rounded. Hold on, let me see. This will work. Ugh, this is hard. Which one? Which one? Oh no, I got it. Okay, there we go. No big deal. Okay, I think I might go with this one. I don't which one to go for? Just give me a minute. And I'll decide. I decided on this big one. So you're going to have to glue it right here. I'm first going to like press it down to make a little mark on it. Where I'm going to put that. I don't know if you can see that. But I put a little mark. Ah! Yeah, I put a little mark right there. Next, you want to glue this one down with a hot glue gun, which I did not plug in because I'm not prepared. So just let me go do that. Okay, no, I just saw, did, I like, already, I already said that. Okay, I hot glued this one, the joystick down, like that. And now I'm just going to take some paint and do some more details. See you, right? Okay, so I just did all the details with a toothpick and some white paint. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, okay, we got that dramatic exit taken care of. No idea what that thing was, it was like a hairy caterpillar. I can see her right now, she's been shooting away from me. Oh my gosh. <coughs> okay. So, I finished the controller. Look how cute that is. Like I said, I did it with a white paint and toothpick. I'm just like keeping my eye on it. So this is really cute. It turned out as better as, I mean, it turned out really good, better than I thought. It's just really cute. I really like it. Um, I love the three dimensional shape. It's a 2D. I was going to do like extra layers of craft foam, but that will be a little, little, little to, I just don't want to do it, okay? Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please leave a like and subscribe to Play ABC if you haven't already. Make sure to ring the bell. Ding dong, ding dong. Did you guys find the mermaid emoji? Well, if you did, I also had a second emoji in it. Try to guess what that second emoji I, I put in the video. So, yeah. See you later tonight's video or later video. Bye. Peace out.